With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, students. The question is at equilibrium. So we are given four options. We have to find out which one is correct. So at equilibrium, the delta G naught and about E naught cell is given. At equilibrium. So first of all, delta G is equal to delta G naught plus R T L N Q, where Q is the reaction quotient. That is the concentration of the products raised to power their stoichiometric coefficient divided by the concentration of the reactants raised to power their stoichiometric coefficient. and it is at any stage of the reaction at any stage of reaction now at equilibrium at equilibrium this q becomes k that is the equilibrium constant and at equilibrium the value of delta g is equal to 0 and delta g is related to the cell potential as minus nf e cell it means if delta e g is zero at equilibrium at equilibrium if delta g is zero it means e cell will also be zero because it is related to this delta g is equals to minus nf e cell F is the Faraday's constant and is the number of electrons involved. It means at equilibrium, delta G is zero and E cell is zero. So in the options, if we see, it is given E naught cell and delta G naught. So these are these standard values are not equal to zero. So in this option, B option, E naught cell is equal to zero. This is incorrect, but this is correct. Delta G is zero. So but the overall option is incorrect, and C is given. Both are correct. This is also incorrect. So the correct option is none is correct because delta G is zero and E cell is zero at equilibrium. So the correct answer is none is correct. I hope you understood the solution. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.